girls, welcome back to another episode of Zero Waste Closet. So you guys had a great response to last week's video and I so appreciate that. I so enjoyed all of your comments and feedback. It was all about minimalism because you know this channel is all about reducing what you need and making the most of what you've got. And so I know it seems ironic because I am in the clothing sale business, but my goal is to really help you guys find the perfect pieces for you so that you don't keep amassing things that you just don't need and spending a life where you're just wading through clutter. So last week we talked about five minimalist mantras to live by when getting dressed. And this week I wanted to present to you guys, well, pre I say present, except that I have already presented this a thousand times, my favorite, favorite all-time minimalist piece, meaning my favorite core go-to piece in my closet over and over again. I will never be able to get enough of this piece of clothing. And seven different ways I plan on wearing my favorite minimalist piece this spring. So take a guess, what do you guys think that piece is? Ding, 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 you're right. It's the white Riley shirt from Velvet Heart. And gals, if you're new to this channel, I'll just give you a brief introduction to this shirt. This is not just a simple white button down shirt. This shirt is fabulous for so many reasons. And you're gonna see today, one of the reasons we love it so much is that it just has so much styling potential. There are so many different ways that you can wear this shirt to just create a really stylish and very wearable outfit. Outfit. So we're going to see some of those things. But I also love this shirt because it is made from Tencel, which is an all natural fiber. It's very soft. It's very easy to launder. And in my opinion, it stays cool to the touch. If you live in a hot environment in summer, like we do here in Arizona, it's just one of those great pieces to have and it travels really well. So many of you already have this shirt. If you don't, of course, you know, you can get it through Chill Boutique and uh, they often run out. So know that we can always get more if we're any reason we're out of stock. We've always got these shirts on order. And gals, if for any reason you don't plan to buy the shirt, you don't have the budget, whatever your reason may be, that's fine. Take inspiration from this video for any white button down shirt you've got. And I guarantee the styling tricks will work. So let's take a look at these seven ideas. All right, gals, so styling idea number one for my white Riley shirt, and this is absolutely one of my favorites, is to pop it on with a great pair of denim shorts. And you know, if you guys have been following me, you know I have a little bit of trepidation about showing my legs because I always feel so pale. But I will tell you, I really discovered something in the process here. If you put on the right color, and we've definitely talked about finding your personal color palette, you will find that certain colors actually bring out a different skin tone. So I. I found that this kind of champagne off-white colored short just in from just black denim really actually made me feel not so pale. And so I love, I also love white on white and tonal dressing. So all I did was I took the white Riley shirt and I did a nice little half tuck into the denim shorts, threw a beach bag over my arm, a great pair of leather gladiator sandals from Bed Stew. And I just feel so summer casual cool. And this is a very simple minimalist feeling outfit. Look number two gals carries forward that half tuck concept. So this is definitely one of the primary ways I love styling the white Riley is just to tuck it in the front and let it hang loose in the back because if you have seen it in person and you recall, it's got a really nice split back and it just has a really lovely drape to it. It's very flattering on most body types. I truly love this shirt. So in this case, I take some of my favorite joggers of the season. These are the linen joggers by Urban Daisy. Gals, we've been selling these like crazy, wonderful price point, very easy, lightweight denim. It's got a cargo style and it has a cuffed bottom. So for those of you who are more in the petite department, they're really nice because the inseam isn't overly long and they hit right at the ankle and stay there. And we just cut them in an olive. So I just take the Riley, I half tuck it into my olive joggers, pair it back to some high wedges, which by the way are crazy comfortable from 
from OTBT. They feel like you're walking on sneakers and just a nice little crossbody bag. And again, it's a very simple, easy outfit. I feel really pulled together, but super loungy at the same time. Another way I absolutely love to wear the Riley shirt is to tie it at the waist. And in fact, I often say it kind of takes the place of like a cropped little denim jacket. If you need something to accentuate the waistline, take the Riley shirt, throw it over the top and cinch it. And bam, you've got a wonderful figure. It's just a really great piece to work with that way. So I'm gonna show you a couple of looks with tight at the waist. The first is to take a nice wide leg pant. I love these in just here from Great and Gather. Beautiful. They have the split leg on the side, which again, if you're petite is really nice because you can actually tie them at the bottom and sort of customize the length on these guys. So in this case, I take the Riley, I tie it at the waist over my wide leg pants, pair it back to a really cute little white booty, which by the way, all the rage this season, the little white booties. I'll be wearing boots all summer, by the way. And again, very fresh, very kind of laid back, very polished look, so beautiful. And gals, this is definitely a trick too. If you have struggle with wearing wide leg pants, really throwing a top over the top and tying it at the waist is a great way to make them work for you where you don't just feel kind of big all over because of that wide leg. Another way I really like to utilize the white Riley shirt with a tie at the waist is to pop it over something like a slip dress, any kind of maxi dress that maybe has a spaghetti strap or a strapless or even a jumpsuit like that. In this case, absolutely beautiful, new in from Velvet Heart, this gorgeous turquoise slip dress. This is so pretty, I love it, but maybe I just wanna be a little warmer, maybe it's cool outside, maybe I feel like I have to wear a bra with it and I'm just not real comfortable with the spaghetti strap or maybe I just don't wanna show my arms. So all I do is I just take the white Riley, put it over the top. In this case, I like it where I don't button it at all. I just get it to the place where my waistline hits and just tie it at the waist as tight as I want to, to my level of comfort but to really give it a waistline and here I pop it on with a nice cowboy boot and a great little beach bag and I feel really really summarized. Yet another way I absolutely love to wear the Riley shirt is to just wear it open like a little shirt jacket. That's really, really easy. And I will tell you guys, this is a really nice trick as well for those of you who are a little bit fuller through the bust or maybe broader through the shoulders and feel like you struggle to wear things that button up. This is a struggle I often see. Well, all you have to do is wear it open and pop a little white tank or any color tank underneath and it works. Bam, perfect shirt ever. So in this case, I take a nice tie pants pant like these pants from Tees by Tina love these really pretty with the pinstripe these come in a lot of different colors too gals they're so comfortable and for just sort of a beachy look I put a white tank on I pop the Riley on wear it open over that and then I put on the new white Sorel slides that are like the most comfortable shoes ever and I feel totally like I am on a sunny vacation for the true style minimalists out there that really want dressing to be easy, where you just don't wanna have to work at all. You guys, the Riley shirt is perfect because in fact, you really don't have to do anything with this shirt for it to look fabulous. So as you'll see, it's got the fringe bottom. As we already know, it's got the split back. You can actually just wear this shirt out by itself, like super duper easy. And this is why I do say it kind of trumps most white shirts that I have seen, just because of its ability to just not really be styled at all and it just falls so beautifully, which is a function of the way it is cut and also of the flowy fabric, the tensile fabric. So in this case, I just take a great pair of skinny jeans, like these new jeans in here from Coco and Carmen. I love it. In this case, it's like a fun novelty jean and throw the Riley on top and super easy. I've got a great outfit, pop them on with my favorite bed stew, little ankle booties, a nice little pop of color bag, bag and I feel totally edgy. This would be a great outfit to go out in the evening in. And friends, last but not least, maybe not something you would necessarily think of, the Riley shirt is great layered underneath things. Now come fall or winter, it's a great piece to put under a sweater, for instance, or under a blazer, but we're moving into the warmer months and we're talking about my spring looks. Well, you guys know I absolutely love overalls. So you've seen these before from Pole. We have a lot of different colors and varieties, but 
you know what? Maybe I wanna wear my overalls and not look so unbelievably laid back like they convey most of the time. Usually I'll pop a t-shirt or a body suit underneath, but maybe I just wanna look more polished. Well, by putting the Riley underneath, it actually just levels it up a notch. And then I put it on with some great little slides just in from Naked Feet. And I have a really cute look that actually looks kind of put together and not so weekend. Gals, I really hope today's video helped you think of all kinds of creative ways that you can get as much mileage as possible out of one of hopefully your favorite pieces in your closet too. So if you are in need of the Riley shirt or need help with styling, please make sure to come visit us in store here in Fountain Hills if you're in Arizona or jump online anytime to www.shopchillstyle.com and I will definitely link to the shirt in the description box below if you would like to purchase it online. As I said, if for any reason we're out of stock of your size, just give us a call here at the store or just wait a few days. We've always got more coming in. If you guys have any questions, ideas, thoughts, concerns, make sure to leave a comment in the comment box below or go ahead and email me at lisa at shopchillstyle.com. If you guys like this week's video, please give it a thumbs up. You know that really helps this channel, helps my metrics. It's wonderful for getting this video to the top of the watch list. So I really appreciate that. And also make sure you jump on and subscribe to this YouTube channel, Zero Waste Closet. That way you guys get notifications whenever new videos come out. Thanks so much, you guys. And I can't wait to see you in the next one.